I was glad to see two of our senior starters uh, really shine tonight, find ways to make winning plays all night long. And that fourth quarter, I felt like those two just owned it. They just made play after play after play. Head coach Dave Slifer is talking about Kayana Lee, who played great one-on-one -on -one defense in the post, and Kelsey Williams, who handled the offense, making sure Janine's basketball made good decisions. Those two helped lead Central Missouri to a 70-57 to win over Union in the Final Four. 57 points is a season low for the Bulldogs. They were averaging 80 a game with a good presence in the paint that Lee put a stop to. I think just quickness and reacting quickly and just being in the spot early for me. Um, I try to make them shoot over me, but obviously a lot of girls are bigger than me, so just getting in the right, right position at the right time is usually what works out. Union was also a great three-point shooting team. They hit 11 in the Elite Eight, but only four against the Jennies held to 24%. Bulldogs also averaged the fewest turnovers in all of Division II. The Jens forced them into 14 and grabbed seven steals. 18 points off turnovers for UCM, and the Jennies won the rebounding battle 34-25. to I knew they were going to make a run, and we just had to be able to score enough to withstand it, and we did. Boy, my thrilled that our kids were able to, to rebound the ball as well as they did and I thought we controlled the tempo. I thought they were very frustrated the first half just because they you know they just couldn't put the ball in the hole but I, I think a lot of the reason was the things we were doing. The Jenny shot 49 percent led by Megan Skaggs with 15 points. Lee added 14 and 11 rebounds. Williams had 13 and 7 and Paige Redmond finished with 12 points. The thing about Williams though is sometimes Slifer has to coax that scoring out of her. I have all these girls behind me that can shoot the ball tremendously. I mean, I look to go to them. It's obvious, but there's times where I need to step up and I know it, and coaches talk to me about it several times. And so I think that there's some times when they look to go to me and I need to take that shot. Jenny's basketball will now play for the national title against defending champ and undefeated Ashland Friday night at 7 o'clock. We've just got a, a mature bunch of kids that understands what's important. And... You don't always get that.